So what we're doing now is using the new Genius PRP system. We've drawn up 60 cc's of blood and we're going to put it into this great new PRP device. We can get 9 times 9x PRP in the matter of about 90 seconds. So we fill up this chamber with 60 cc's. They have two different types of chambers, a 30 cc and a 60 cc. The 30 cc chamber can be used twice. The 60 cc chamber can only be used once. Obviously you use it on the same patient. So we go through uh, three different types of spins to get the uh, PRP. We get 6 cc's when we're done. And so I'm going to stand a little further back because it's very loud and we're going to start doing a 60 se uh, second spin and it's almost like the size of a Nutribullet and for 60 seconds it's doing a spin and then when uh, the, so we do a double spin after that and then we do actually a third spin so it only takes 90 seconds to get your PRP Previously, I was using a Magellan system to get um, similar PRP, but that took 15 minutes. So this system is a lot quicker. So we're almost done with the first spin. We got 25 seconds left. So we're going to use the PRP for hair restoration, and we've been doing this for about five years. And what you do is you inject it into the areas where there's thinning hair and it makes the hair thicker and um, more dense. So in areas where there's absolutely no hair and no peach fuzz, it doesn't work. It works on the areas where the hair is thinner. Um, and that happens with aging. So, so the hair follicle size gets smaller. So now we're on the phase two spin cycle. And that's going to be about 15 to 30 seconds. So typically a male will need uh, one to two to three treatments per year. A female probably only needs one treatment every nine to 12 months, maybe even longer. Females are much better candidates than males, but males can also be treated. I'll show you my befores and afters on another video. Um, I've been treated three times previously with PRP, and now um, this will be my fourth time. My last treatment was over a year ago. And so we're almost done. And then we're going to start treating uh, my hair with the PRP. We're going to use the Pronox systems. So there, we are absolutely done with the PRP spin and we're going to take a cannula and we're going to draw up the remainder of uh, the PRP from the Genius system. So here we are drawing up the PRP out of the Genius system and we should get about 6 cc's and then we're going to inject it. So there we go. It's a great system, very quick, very fast. It was developed by Dr. Tahizade, who also helped develop the Magellan system. So what we're left with is the six cc's of PRP, 9x, which is great concentrated PRP, and then this system here. So all the blood and PPP is in this base here, and then we obviously throw that away and. Um, medical waste. We can't reuse this. So it's very simple, almost foolproof. So now we have the PRP prepared and we added a smidge of lidocaine. A friend of mine, Dr. Mitch Chazen, told me that that's okay. So a half a cc of lidocaine, plain, 1%. And we're going to use the Pronox system, which is going to give me a little edge off of the discomfort. We clean the hair with laser sin, which is hypochlorous acid and we'll get started. So I'm going to start on the Pronox.
Completed my PRP injection of the hair. It was almost painless using the Pronox system. Uh, and the results will take actually three, four months to start to kick in. 